Hi, Hi everyone. everyone, I'm Mia. And I'm Angelina. We are junior scientists at BioBus. And welcome to another Explore at Home weekly challenge. Today, we will be talking about osmosis. Osmosis is the movement of water across a membrane. Osmosis explains why an egg swells to look like this and why an egg shrinks to look like this when they are placed in different liquids. The changes that you see in these eggs also happens in the cells in our bodies too. So for this experiment, let's pretend that these eggs are our cells. Now keep in mind, this experiment takes four to five days, but it is totally worth it. So are you ready? Let's go. So first, the materials you need for this experiment are two eggs, two cups, it can be glass, plastic, it doesn't matter, vinegar, you might need a lot, corn syrup, or you can also use pancake syrup or maple syrup, water, a ruler to measure the amount of substance left in each cup, and finally, a notebook and pen or pencil to write down observations plus hypothesis. Fill up the cup about two-thirds of the way with vinegar or enough vinegar to cover your egg. I use one cup of vinegar, but this depends on the size and shape of your cup. Then place the egg in the cup. The egg will want to float, but make sure that both eggs are fully covered by vinegar. Let the egg rest for about 24 hours in the refrigerator. When the egg is in the vinegar, what kind of observations can you make? Vinegar is actually a weak acid, which reacts with the eggshell to break the shell down and release the carbon dioxide gas. After 24 hours, gently pour out the vinegar from the cup and fill out the cup again with the same amount of vinegar. While we wait, let's talk more about osmosis. What is osmosis? Osmosis is how water likes to flow from a solution with less dissolved particles, but more water, to a solution with more dissolved particles and less water. This is actually how water moves into and out of our cells in our bodies. Our cells need the right amount of water in it to keep its shape, make energy, and keep us healthy. So osmosis is very important. The cell membrane of our cells is responsible for letting water move in and out. The cell membrane is the thin layer around the cells of all living things. So our cell membrane, which is semi-permeable, only allows water and small molecules to pass through. Other molecules, like some sugars and proteins, are too big to pass. Now two days have passed. You want to wait until the eggshell has dissolved, then gently take out the egg. Gently rinse the egg with water and gently rub some of the leftover shell. And we have now made a naked egg. Instead of the hard shell, we now have a semi-permeable membrane. So now that the eggshells have dissolved, place one egg into the cup with the syrup and the other egg in the cup with the water. You can add food color into the cup with the water if you like some extra scientific fun. Measure the height of the corn syrup and water before putting the egg in. We will let them sit for another 24 hours in the refrigerator. Which solution will make the egg become smaller? Which solution will make the egg become bigger? Write down your hypothesis. Gently take out the eggs out of the cups. Do not pour the liquid out. Take down observations and compare and contrast the eggs. Measure their weight using scale or you can also use your hand. Feel which egg feels heavier and which egg feels lighter than it originally was. Lastly, measure the amount of substances that is left in each cup and record this. Now, what happens if you switch out the eggs and put them in the opposite solutions? If you have enough syrup left, please try this. If you like this experiment and you want to explore osmosis more, we challenge you to make your own osmosis experiment. Instead of corn syrup, what happens if you use another solution? Or instead of eggs, if you use a certain vegetable? Like the eggs, our cells respond very similarly. When we don't drink enough water, we are dehydrated. And if it continues, water will move from inside of our cells to the bloodstream. This causes our cells to shrivel like the egg, and this is very dangerous for our health. This also explains why when you don't water your plants, their leaves wilt. Osmosis causes the water to move out of the plant cells, which causes the cell to shrink and lose the structure needed to support the plant. And now that you have completed the excellent osmosis challenge, it's time for us to say goodbye, right Angelina? Right, we will see you guys in the next one. Upload your results on your eggs in the link below. And don't forget to follow BioBus on Instagram and subscribe to their YouTube channel for more fun, amazing Explore Home challenges. Bye! Bye.